Hi guys. Okay, I had started this video when I started working on my spread here, my plan with me. And at some point, my camera went wonky and it stopped recording. I don't know what happened. I don't know why. So we're going to just start you from here. I have, uh, I'll show you what I've already done. I've done my headers, done my bottoms. I done my sidebar, which I did one just geared towards me since I did design this for me where I have my bills, my purchases, my to-dos, and my goals. I really like that sidebar that way. So I thought it'd be more functional for me that way. I was going to do the boxes that I had made, these here, but I decided to do some washi. I'm really liking the washi, the new washi, which I did haul in another video. And it looks okay so far. I'm really liking the headers here that I made for the different days. I didn't even get that one straight, so you'll get to see me fix that one. And um, I wanted to make this more fall, not so much just Thanksgiving, because I will have a Thanksgiving spread. So this one is more fall, only fall. So what I did was, for my date covers, I did little uh, leaves. I thought they turned out so cute. I really like them. I like how they're covering up the dates. And that's where I was at when I noticed that my camera had clicked off. So we'll take it from there. I guess since it is wanting to click off and you've missed so much out on it. And my little girl doggies are being quiet right now. They're older so they do tend to be a little bit whiny at times. I do apologize for that. They start whining during the video. Because um... Like I said, they just, they're older, they're 14 years old, and they just have moments where they don't feel good at all. So we'll finish putting the uh, day covers on there. And I may, or I may not, when I edit, speed through this process. So I'm not going to talk through it in case I do speed through it. There's no, not much sense. So from here on out, it will probably be silent if I don't speed through it. Oh, I did want to interject into this. The use of the tweezers was something that I saw another plan with me individual do. She has a um, channel. It's called Home with Tanya. I will link it below. I do highly advise that if you like to watch these type of things, you will love watching her. She puts several up a week. She does tutorials. She, she's just a joy to watch. And I do make sure that I watch every one of her videos. I wait and wait for something to come out. I mean, I check it three and four times a day. So, I do enjoy her videos very much. I highly suggest them. And her idea of using the tweezers for the smaller date covers, it, it was just a, a lifesaver. It was. It kept me from going crazy with all the little stuff. And it made it so much easier, so much faster. Not so much trying to take it up and reposition. Um, I didn't use them on my... up here on these. And I wish I had, but... I didn't have them in here with me at the time. I just went and got them a little while ago. But I will keep them by my side, or at least a pair by my side from now on for doing that kind of stuff. Because I am doing some header covers this month that I designed. Some day, co uh, day covers. So I will need the tweezers for sure. Oh, I skipped 14 there. Like I said earlier which it didn't record what I said so I'll say it again I designed this myself for me I got me a silhouette and I'm designing my own packets and that is why this is so late coming up because I'm still in the learning process of what I want to do and how I want to do it and I don't want every month to look the same so I'm trying to switch it up a bit um, I'm learning the lengths and the measurements and the dimensions and I did there was a few things that were off this month on this monthly one but 
I will adjust for next month and I did make it work for this month so all's good not a big deal at least not to me I mean I'm not a perfectionist there's no if I was a perfectionist I'd go crazy because I am in no way near perfect <laughs> so I try not to be I try not to expect others to be and it's just easier that way and I really do enjoy doing these stickers it's just that I I get one thing in my mind and I change my mind and I I'm like oh no I want to do it this way and so it takes me forever to get them done which in turn takes me forever to post my videos and my plan with me and I do apologize for that I'm still new at this I think this is only my third one I do hope I get better at it to more to your liking and I do hope that I get faster at it but time will tell like with anything else time will tell with that and just kind of go with the flow I do and like I said I don't expect perfection and you know things don't always work out the way you think they will when you're designing it one with one thing in mind something else might happen so you have to learn to adjust to roll with the punches and I just enjoy doing this for me um, I got me two other planners one's going to be for my uh, freelance work and my personal business and the other one's going to be a journal of sorts I probably won't ever really one of them I'm never going to probably really write in much because I'm thinking I'm going to use it more as just a to decorate because it does relax me I do enjoy the decorating them and so I'm thinking maybe I'll use it more for recreation than I will anything else which is fine like I said I do enjoy designing them and doing the plan with me I've only done the three and I'm having so much fun with them I ordered me a recollections um, personal size which I will probably use for the business and the freelance work and I did order me some so I think it's so much crafting or so crafty or something like that inserts to go with it in the vertical line I am waiting on both of those to arrive I'm just on pins and needles on that and I also did order me the new mini happy planner which will probably either that one or this one will be just for decorating the other will probably be my personal journal and um, just that kind of stuff so I mean I'll decorate them all and we'll probably videotape that but not every one of them will be written into will be inked like this one today will not have any ink in it because I'm still deciding once I get my mini planner if I will be inking at it or in this one so I'm just doing the monthly spread as you can see about to finish up the number covers here and um, I'm going to get a few other things put in it but other than that I may ink my bills and my purchases and stuff like that because that is something that will really come in handy then again I may just use that as a, an initial design for future sidebars so I don't know yet how to go with that I, I really like that concept of the bills and the purchases and everything and I can always change that out to just like bills and whatever it doesn't have to be purchases I mean it could be appointments or anything like that I mean I'll just kind of go with, see with what I need for that month and I might need to have in that sidebar and go from there Okay, and so the number covers are down. So next, we need to do some of these special days. Now, I do know that Daylight Savings Time is the Sunday before election. So, we'll go ahead and put that one down right here. So we will know to fall back one hour. I like the extra hour of sleep, but I don't like it getting darker over here, so that, that's, it is what it is. Then up next we have election day.
which is on the 8th. Not so sure I'm going to vote yet. I really don't know who I'd vote for. I'm really not impressed by anyone. So I will probably skip this year. I know it's a right that we have to do, and I know it's our it's expected of us as Americans, but this year, maybe not so much voting for me. So we will see. It'll probably be one of those deals. Depends on how I feel when the day actually rolls around. Next up, we have Veterans Day. My father was in the military for a short while, and Veterans Day and any day that honors our veterans is very special to me, and I do encourage all of you out there to honor our veterans. Uh, we are free and can do these plan with me's on the internet and on YouTube because they made it possible. Our freedoms are all because of them, and we need to remember that. We really do. Many people have lost sight of it. The next time went up is Thanksgiving. Wonderful day. I love it. When my parents were alive, it was just the best day. It's just me and the girls now, so it tends to be a very somber, quiet holiday, but we do enjoy like every other day together. And then right after Thanksgiving is the day Black Friday. I will not be shopping out amongst the crowds this year for Black Friday. I have decided to do my Black Friday online, so I really need to try and get together my list of those shops that are advertising that they may have specials. Because if I'm going to order, I'd like to order on Black Friday, save a little bit. I'm all about saving. So, really need to start pinching the pennies. Um, I have been told hours will be cut back at the job next year, and so until I can really get the shop off the ground, then it's going to be a while. Then, after Black Friday, of course, we have Cyber Monday or Blue Monday. I mean, whichever day you want to call it. But online deals on that day, too, which is cool. And then those are the major holidays that I really worried about. I'm sure there's other days in there. I've heard there's like fast food day and donut day and all that. But these are the ones that I want to remember and keep in mind. Now I do want to put a little bit of deco on here. And I did make a few deco items for this one. So I think I will go ahead and put those down. Because they are, it's just, I have them, I might as well use them. So, and they are fall themed. I mean, they're not like Thanksgiving or anything like that. So, we will go ahead and use them. I did put leaves on these all down through here. But I did it thinking, well, I might want to go ahead and put some acorns on there. So, that is what I will do acorns down for my deco and I have a couple pumpkins left I'm really not sure where I'm going to put those at yet let's see where can we put them we could put one up here and maybe one down here I really don't like those empty boxes I wish I had something to fill those in with I guess I could put some of this on This is the glittery pumpkins that I got at Target Dollar Spot that I thought were just too stinking cute. So I guess I could get them. Put them down. And we can put some of those down. They might look cute on here. Getting these started that's a little bit different on these tape can be a pain. Because they are individual like, like that. So, we'll go ahead and start down there. Yep, maybe, maybe not. I'm not the best at judging these things. 
just not the best at any of this. But I do so enjoy doing it. I find it very relaxing. It, and it does use my creativity, which anything that helps me use my creativity, I'm all for. I believe it keeps your brain strong. And where I live remotely, there's not too much to do as far as entertainment anyways. So, I like to do as much creative at home as I can. So, that's why these planner videos are so much fun for me. Let's see if I can get that edge off without messing it up. I don't know. Yeah, now that looks cute. That works. Look at some up here, too. That works real cute. Let's see. It doesn't want to let go. Let's see, we got two days to cover. So we'll do it like that. There. That is just too stinking cute. But cut that. Not a biggie. I'll get my little scissors out just a minute. Much easier to manage these ones. These are my embroidered scissors that my mother gave me shortly before she passed away, and I cherished them greatly. At one point, I thought I had lost them, and I was just in a total funk for a whole week. And then, I come to find out, I had just misplaced them. So I was tickled to death, and just so happy. I think I'm going to leave that overlapping there. It's not going to hurt a thing. So, there's that. Get this one back up and out of the way because it's just going to be all over the place. Let's see. I do like that those are, that comes off individual like that. I think that is so cute. That really helps to decorate those empty boxes. Oh, I overlapped it too far here. My bad take care of that right now while I'm thinking of it. Boy, it sure likes to grip. Might have to leave it there on number three. Yeah, I just might have to leave it. Oh, there it comes. I thought most watchy tape is removable, but then I don't know. I'm new in it, so. Who knows? Not I. Not me. Go ahead and take it over to that one. And then I think I'll salvage some of these and put them elsewhere. Let's see where are we going to put them. Let's see. We will do one of here, so we do have some glitter there and behind it, and we will do, I still have two little tiny deco ones over here, just don't like the idea of wasting this washi, that one's messed up, so it's not a big deal to let it go, and I might do one there, there, I do like the glitter, it, it's way cool. And this doesn't seem to come off as bad as this other stuff up here from the dollar store. So that's that's very cool, too. So there's that. Let's see. Do we have anything else? Are any flags that I need to worry about? I don't think I do. can't think of anything going on in November for right off. Put my other two pumpkins down here somewhere. Well, I guess we'll put the uh, another one here. Got those two there underneath the tree. Then we'll just leave the other one. So I did do my um, 
22 days till Thanksgiving. I did run them off, but I'm going to wait on them. I'm going to use them on the weekly. I just wanted to fill this sheet up. Not sure what I'll use these for now. I might use them when I plan my other planners. They might work in that. For some reason, they did come up too small to come in here. I thought I'd measured correctly, but I must not have. So, let's see. Don't want to put something down through there. I guess I could put that plaid. Let's see how that works. I don't know. It's not wide enough, no. I don't want to put the leaves because I've got a lot of the leaves. So I guess we'll leave it at that. So that's it. That's my November spread. So let's get that put back into my planner. This is something I will show you that I'm trying to come up with for myself. I'm trying to do a meal planner. I'd like to do a grocery list. I'd like to do maybe a bill planner. And you know, if I don't decide to keep them in the sidebars on the weeks and um, stuff like that. So that's just a concept I've come up with. Um, this is just a regular piece of paper, notebook paper. My corner round messed it up. But this is just a working model. That's why I have the washi down each side. It was to reinforce a little bit so I could put it in here and it wouldn't go wonky on me. But I'd like to have one designed up probably here in the next month or so. I don't know. I'm waiting for my other planners to come in and see how they are. It might be something I use in my mini planner if I decide to ink in it. I just really do not know yet. So I'm sorry that you didn't get to see the whole I need to put the whole process on this one and that my camera went dead I really do apologize for that I I just don't know what's wrong with it here lately it's just it's my iPhone and it's just been just been acting up and I'm not sure why but I'm glad I caught it when I did before I completely finished so I could share some of this with you and um, so all was not lost. I would love to have a hole punch, but I just can't justify the cost when I can do it this way. And it worked just as well. So I went through my pumpkin there. Um, so let's get it put back in and see how it looks. The spread looks within the Happy Planner. I think it turned out good. I'm trying to go more minimal. I thought maybe if you were, I don't know if you remember my last week's spread. My first spread was the breast cancer. And after doing it, I decided, well, I'm not going to do so whole hog. And, you know. Well, then my next week was Halloween. And I went whole hog again. So, and my first monthly that I did, it was kind of minimal. But there was a lot of boxes and a lot of flashiness. And I just did not, I wasn't too happy with this one. So I thought I'd go minimal this time, more coordinated as far as colors. And I think I really liked the way this one turned out. I really like doing this up here like this, with this shorter header. And I really like this whole goals and everything down the side. And the washi tape, I'm thinking I'm liking it better than the individual box items. And then with my special days that I need to remember. So that's how it turned out. I hope you enjoyed watching what little bit you could see before, after I realized what was going on with the camera. Um, keep your eyes open. I will be doing the week of the 31st through the 6th as soon as I finish designing that. Again, I'm wanting to go minimal, so I still have a few things I need to work on that. But it should be coming up here pretty soon. And as always, thank you for watching. Uh, please subscribe, comment, share, and like. I am trying to build my subscriber base. I hope you enjoy the, watching these as much as I enjoy doing them. And as always, from me and the girls here at Hattie's Attic Sweet Dreams, have a blessed day and a happy week. Bye, guys.